Welcome back to Mr. Rules class, where we make every day a good day. Today we're going to be talking about the culture of the Southwest. Uh, so let's do our before true and false questions to begin with. Number one, more Native Americans live in the Southwest region than any other region of the United States. True or false? Number two, many of the foods served in the Southwest region are spicy. True or false? Now let's read about the culture of the Southwest. Food. Tortillas are important ingredients in, tra in traditional Southwestern cooking. The tortilla acts as a wrapper or a bread. Wedges of tortillas are fried to make tortilla chips, nachos, tacos, en enchiladas, quesadillas, burritos are made with tortillas. Because many kinds of hot chili peppers are grown in the Southwest, many of the foods served there are spicy. Green chili peppers are made into salsa. Red chili peppers are used in slow-cooked dishes. The most popular slow-cooked dish is chili con carne, often known simply as chili. Chili con carne, chili with meat, is made with meat simmered in a sauce of dried red chili peppers, tomatoes, and a variety of spices. Contests are held throughout the Southwest to choose the best chili. Tomales are made from masa, a dough of corn, with a filling of shredded beef that has been stewed with red chilies and spices. They are wrapped in corn husks and steamed. The corn husks are removed at the table before the tomales are eaten. While tamales are served throughout the year in restaurants in the Southwest, tamales are traditional Christmas food. Families and friends gather and to assemble dozens of tamales. Southwestern desserts are fairly simple, served as a soothing finish to a spicy meal. Sopapillas, a kind of deep fried donuts, are served as a dessert with honey. Another favorite dessert is flan, a baked custard. People. Parts of the Southwest once belonged to Spain and Mexico. Spain sent priests to the Southwest in the early 1700s. The priests built churches and missions where they taught the Native Americans about the Christian religion. In 1845, Texas decided to split off from Mexico and join the United States. This caused a war between Mexico and the United States over who own, owned the land. The United States won. Mexico had to give the land to the United States, but parts of, of Spanish and Mexican culture are still seen in the region. Many people in the Southwest speak Spanish. Many foods and festivals in the region come from Spain or Mexico. Many buildings are made in Spanish, Mexican, and Native American styles. The Southwest has many Spanish American and Native American people. More Native Americans live in the Southwest than in any other region of the United States. The Navajo Reservation is the home of the biggest American Indian tribe. Many of the Navajo who live there still follow their Native American traditions, while others have a more modern lifestyle. Some people live in modern homes, while others live in traditional homes called Hogan's. Other tribes of the Southwest include the Hopi, Zuni, and Apache. All right, so let's talk about culture by answering these questions. More Native Americans live in the Southwest than in any other region? Yep, you guessed it. It is true. Let me pull up my text box here. Very true. Number two, many of the foods in the Southwest region are spicy. All right, that is true as well. All right, the native the name uh, the, name the Native American tribes that live in the Southwest region. All right. So we're going to write this in complete sentences. So the Native American tribes that live in the South Wow, Southwest 
region include the Hopi, Zuni, Pueblo, uh, let's see, Apache, and the biggest one is the Navajo. Navajo. Okay. All right. And I think native is supposed to be capitalized. There we go. List some of the foods that are made with tortillas. Woo! Yummy. Some of the foods that are made with tortillas include quesadillas, quesadillas, burritos, tacos. Let's go see what the other ones are. Mmm, getting hungry thinking about all these. All right, nachos, tacos, enchiladas, quesadillas, and burritos. I'm just going to copy that and bring it down here. Nachos, tacos, enchiladas, quesadillas, and burritos. And there we have it. We have finished our Southwest uh, packet. Now remember to go out and make it a great day.